Hey, what's up? It's your girl Queen checking in. I'm back with another video. I'm back with another video. Hi, Miss Parker. Hi, boy. Your girl back on the truck. Of course, you know your girl back on her grind. I'm going to take you guys with me throughout my day, throughout my week, pretty much. If you guys want to see more content like this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. Now, let's get into the video. Let's get into the video. Let's get into the video. local lows because my teammate was attacked by a dog earlier what happened to you got bitten in the ass today son by a stinking ass filthy dog i know a dog like that ass if she allows me or if she doesn't mind me putting in a little clip of her getting her needle a needle in her foot i'll put a little clip in it But she had to go get stitches. So while she's doing that, pray for her and her foot, her her, her her foot, like crazy, y'all, crazy, crazy. I'm actually gonna talk about myself. I'm gonna get ready to run some local loads. So I decided to take you guys with me to show you guys, you know, basically what I do in a week. I literally just backed into this trailer. So I'm actually gonna connect my glad hands and stuff like that. Found my gloves. I guess we're gonna use my old gloves. I got new gloves. But I don't know where they are right now. I kind of don't feel like looking for them. I just hooked, pretty much just hooked up from here to the trailer. I always put my gloves on because I don't want my hands to get dirty. proceed to check underneath the trailer what I'm checking for is I'm making sure that my fifth wheel is connected and it is definitely properly connected now I'm gonna lift up my landing gear I done that to check my tires but I also need to open this up because I need to make sure that it's empty And this is semi-empty. It's some stuff back there that I'm probably gonna take out just because I don't want the headache or the hassle of them telling me that there's some back there and I already know. I always wanna make sure that your trailer is as cleaned out as possible. See, look at this. Look at all of this cardboard. Until my teammate get back, you know what I'm saying? Three days later. Okay, so I decided right now I'm actually in South Carolina for to get ready to work out. Y'all see what I got on, right? Your girl trying to get fine because she got a trip coming up soon. Y'all see the trip when y'all see the trip. I ain't gonna talk too much about it. Cause I'm not when y'all see me when I first got on her. I was a little skinnier in the face, but as everybody know, I got a little fat in the face. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna work out. So I got my whole little setup my dumbbell. I set up my little pad right here and I'm gonna work out. So I'm gonna show y'all a little bit of me working out and stuff like that. It's getting real out here in the streets. I need to hurry up because it looks like it's about to rain. So I'm done talking. I'm gonna just go ahead and get into the workout. That was 
to work out for the first day, y'all. So don't judge me. Literally, first day that I don't work out in months. I can't even tell you the last time I worked out. But it felt good. And now I'm just ready to lay down somewhere, eat a salad, lay down somewhere. And that's it for the day. The next day. All right, y'all. So I got some pineapples in there. Blueberries. Strawberries. They frozen. What is ice? Right now I am in Flagstaff. Era Zona. I done came to Flagstaff a couple of times. And every time I come to Flagstaff, people be like, oh my God, the showers, they're really nice. Oh my God, you should try out the showers. Depending on how much these showers cost, because you know your girl, <laughs> Pilot Rewards, I get free showers at Pilot, period. I was like, for the second of the video, I'm gonna take y'all to Flagstaff and we are gonna see what these showers cost. So. Let's see how much they go. I mean, if you really want to take a bath, you can come to Flagstaff and they do have tubs. Or if you want to take a shower, you can definitely take a shower. Showers don't really look that bad either. So this isn't bad. I'm, like, I'm not mad at all about the $12 I just spent. Cause it's like a hotel type of vibe. Right now I'm in the bathroom at Flagstaff and like I said, from what I just showed y'all, I'm really not mad at the $12 that I just spent. Cause at first I was like, everybody talking about, oh, go to Flagstaff, they have nice bathrooms. I'm not gonna lie, this bathroom is really nice. Now, would I pay $12 over getting a free shower? So I don't know about that, but, but this is pretty nice. Okay. Okay, and then it's not even like a regular tub, it's like a big tub. Oh my God, look at my face. I'm sorry y'all about my Christmas. They give you a key, hold on to like your ID. It's like a deposit until you bring back the key. When you bring back the key, you get your ID back. So it's not bad. Let's get into the shower. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get in the tub though. I'm not sure about the tub, um, but I'm definitely gonna get in the shower though, for sure. So let me go get my stuff so I can come shower. On my, and right now I'm on my 30 minute break. So if anybody be like, oh, I don't ever have time to shower. You can shower on your 30 minute break. I'm on my 30 minute break right now and I'm gonna shower. So, yeah. I'm gonna Like I said, y'all, I would recommend coming here, but the only thing about coming here is if you are gonna take a bath in the tub, I would suggest you to clean it out because you don't know who asked you in there and you don't know if they've been cleaning it out right now. It is the next day and we have successfully docked our truck. As you can see right here, my teammate right there, here to go open the door and come deliver from outside. But that's pretty much what we do every day. Of course, you see I slept, woke up, and it's early in the morning. I have the paperwork that I'm trying to give them, but 
Yeah, but look how they where they had us back in. And like some random back alley. Three hours later. Before I wrap up this video, y'all already know that I do be cooking in the truck. So let me do a quick little segment of Queen cooking in the truck. <laughs> So I am in my truck. I'm actually at a shipper. I am waiting to get loaded. So why they taking a sweet time? I'm gonna cook. So let me show y'all what I'm gonna cook. Hey y'all, so this is like my cooking set up right now. Right now I have squash and broccoli in there. I do have pre-minced garlic. I love this as you guys can see. I really love it because it's halfway gone. I have blue shrimp that I have already seasoned. I seasoned it with some steak rub. Because steak rub isn't nothing but like an assorted like so sugar, salt, spices, a lot of spices in a blend. Of course, you know your girl love her some Cajun seasoning. That's that slap your mama quick blend. Stop playing with me. Of course, y'all already know. I love me some obey. Obey. Okay, this shit is bombing here. Yes, I added like a little bit of oil. And right now I'm like soft pan my broccoli. Right now I'm just like soft pan my broccoli and stuff. Something nice, simple, and healthy today. And I also am gonna try something new. We went to Sprouts, which is a super healthy store, and they had some organic kiwi brown rice and uh, brown and red rice with black seeds. So I'm gonna cook this. I'm gonna season it with some Cajun seasoning. And I'm gonna put some um, broccoli squash and shrimp over it, and then eat it like that. So. That is the plan. So I got this going right now, cooking for like a quick little minute. And then I'm gonna add the other things. All right y'all, so now I'm gonna take the rest of the little garlic I have and like add that on there, that right there. So I'm gonna scrape the rest of the garlic, I'll put it in there and then I'm gonna mix it up. We started on cooking this rice. This rice, uh, I got it number one because we're in a truck and it's also pre-cooked so you can leave it on high in the microwave for 90 seconds and that's exactly what i'm going to do and then i'm going to season it to give it some more seasoning but that's pretty much what the rice looks like but i'm going to show y'all what it looks like outside the bag so i put the garlic in there as you guys can see and now i'm going to get ready to add my pre-seasoned blue shrimp in there so y'all gonna watch me add that in there i got these from sprouts as well they have some really big colossal looking shrimp so you know the bigger the better the shrimp's on and i'm gonna let these cook until they turn red and while these are cooking up I'm gonna go ahead and start this right Right now I am currently in the dock. I just kind of want to give you guys an idea of what I be doing out here on the road or whatever because I feel like I always just give y'all just general content but I never be like, this is what I do every day. So, thank you guys so much for watching this channel. If you guys want to see more content like this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl and bye.